What's up? It's Yendi. This is Tech Juice. Today is Thursday, October 25th. Five days away from Halloween. What are you guys going to dress up like? I'd love to know. Just don't send me creepy pictures. Big things are happening, like the Microsoft Windows 8 launch tomorrow. And the execs at Microsoft had a talk earlier today in New York all about the app-centric OS. We learned that it will have Skype, Netflix, and Hulu. And Condé Nast has loaded up the New Yorker and Wired magazine. So nice little perks if you got to start using Windows 8. Now, the Surface tablet was also broken down in a live webcast on Pacific time, and you can check that out in the link listed below. I'm so excited, I almost want to do a cartwheel. Almost. Now, what's great and wonderful about the world of technology is that it's constantly changing. Just when you thought you had a handle on something, boom, something new happens. So listen to how cool this story is on computerworld.com. So memory as we know it right now is called non-volatile memory, NVM for short. It's what we find on flash drives and in traditional RAM. Thanks to the latest SSD, the solid state drive technology breakthroughs, Everything's changed. We have more reliable and faster flash memory on the drop of a dime in a traditional computer setting. The Storage Networking Industry Association of America has recognized that memory media such as DRAM and hard drives, the traditional stuff, is changing and will need to change over the next five years in order to be compatible to this new SSD technology flash breakthrough, which means they will be making big changes in architectures of systems as we know it today. More so in the future, you'll use NMV, the non-volatile memory, in your memory hierarchy and not just mass storage. So you're killing two birds with one stone, making things much faster and much more efficient. Because, you know, we love things to go faster. Who wants to go looking for UFOs? Me, I do, this girl right here. Who wants to join me on my expedition? You do, don't you? Well, we're gonna have to start in Chile. That's where we'll find the Vista Telescope. Take a look at this thing. It's in the European Southern Perennial Observatory in Chile, and the Visible Infrared Survey Telescope, which is the long form for Vista, can grab nine gigapixels worth of stars. There's bound to be a UFO sighting with that thing. It reflects 98% of near-infrared light and deviates from perfection by less than 3 nanometers. That's 1 3 thousandth of a human hair's width. That's small. And I want to wish a warm, happy, happy 10-year anniversary to Max Borges PR. That, of course, is where I got my tech craze started. I was the assistant to Max Borges himself when I started off in all this tech wonderment. And I remember those offices being this small. He's grown huge. That firm is huge. And if you're in tech and you want to get your stuff promoted, I guarantee Max Borges PR will do the job for you. Well, that's it for Tech Juice. This is Yendi Valdez, and I'll see you guys next time.